Hey everybody, how are you doing today? Great to see all of you. Cheers. Hope you're having a great day. Welcome. I'm Susan Swanson. I'm with Sun Realty of Florida right here on the gorgeous Gulf Coast. And now my niche is uh, manufacturing and mobile homes inside land lease communities and those attached to real estate. I've been in the real estate industry now for more than 18 years and I do what I love and I love what I do. And make sure you check out my most recent listing. There's a virtual tour of the home right here on my channel and there's also tours of the resort community that the home is in. And it's two and a half miles from the gorgeous Gulf of Mexico. And if you haven't been out to the Gulf lately, you guys, you are missing it. So get out there and sink your toes in the sand and soak up the sun and take a dip because it is the water is just beautiful. It is so nice. So. Be sure and relish in that if you're in the area. And if you're new or coming into the area, welcome. Venice is a beautiful area, as is Nokomis, South Sarasota, Inglewood, Port Charlotte, Northport. We live in a beautiful area of the country, and the Gulf is absolutely gorgeous. So, okay, enough of that. So, today, you guys, I'm going to talk about single wides because there's a lot of them right now on the market. And as usual, you know, I'm on the market, I'm on these sites usually every day. Of course, that's how I start my day with my coffee. And uh, so this morning I went in and I was like, wow, there are a lot of single white homes for sale. So why not talk about it, right? Okay, so the home that I have listed currently is inside a land lease community, which is where you pay a monthly lot rent. When you buy a home in a land lease community, it's considered personal property. So you're going to pay a monthly lot rent, and there are they're all over the board in Sarasota County, really. There can be some small communities that you pay less than $500 a month for. Uh, those homes that are few and far between inside those communities, and that lot rent is few and far between. And then you're going to have lot rent that goes up to high sevens, low eights, thousand, eleven hundred, right up to fifteen hundred in some of these beautiful manufactured and mobile home communities up in Sarasota. Even down in Northport. And in Inglewood, you're going to find lot rents are between, you know, seven, eight hundred, right up to twelve, thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars per month. Now, with real estate, of course, you're buying the home and you're buying the land beneath the home, or in some cases, you're buying a share of the land because that's a cooperative. Okay, you don't buy all the land; you get a share of it. But some people will pay more for those homes, and they are definitely listed for more money. But it's a share of the land. You're also going to have an HOA. You're going to have quarterly fees. You're going to have real estate taxes. You're going to have higher closing costs. The closing may include a deed and title search, so on and so forth if it's private land. So there's many different variations when you buy a real estate owned home rather than that in a land lease. A land lease home can be purchased pretty quickly. We can close in under two weeks if it's a cash deal. And uh, so it's really up to you how you want to go about it. And if you're looking for financing for a manufacturer mobile home, be sure and check out my most recent vlog because I did um, give, I shared some information with you guys about financers for that. And uh, so you definitely want to check that out if you're looking for financing. So there are all types of communities in Sarasota County. There are many that are age qualified, 55 plus, 45 plus, and there are a handful that are all age. And there are unique homes in each community and each community is unique. So some are pet friendly, some are rental friendly. Um, some have pet sections, some will allow no, no pets whatsoever, some will have a lot of amenities, and some will have very little amenities or none at all. So when it comes to manufactured and mobile homes, most of you may know this, but in case you don't, a single wide is a single home, and you'll have one title to that home. If you uh, fall in love with a double wide, it's two sides, one space. You'll have two DMV titles to that home. And if you're lucky enough to find a triple wide, that is three sides to one space, and you would get three DMV titles. And on the title, of course, is a title number, an ID number, the homeowner's number, the address of the home, and then on the back side is a signature line for when the home is transferred. And of course, when you list show or list and sell a home with us at Sun Realty of Florida, we handle all of that for you um, at closing, so no worries. But whether or not you buy a home in a real estate owned community or in a land lease community, there's always an application process to it. You're going to be asked to complete the application in full. There's an application fee, typically it's $50, maybe 45. And if there's two of you on the application, it would be 100 or 90. And then they're gonna to wanna to know if you have any pets. They're gonna to wanna to know where you live currently. They're gonna ask you if you own a rent. They're gonna get into your financials. You're gonna have a complete background check completed. So, you know, don't get overwhelmed with that, but that would be the process, whether or not you're buying in a land lease community for personal property or inside the real estate owned community. And the same would be said 
for a rental occupant if you decide to rent the home and it's allowed in the guidelines. If you choose to rent the home, if you're not using it full time, your occupant will need to complete their occupant application and also have a background check and be approved prior to residing there. Okay, so just words from the wise, you can't really sneak those people in there because it's for liability reasons. And you know, the neighbors would like to know that their part-time neighbors or their part-time rental occupants are approved and they you know, do belong in the community. Okay, and if you have guests, I uh, just one quick side note because the coffee's kicking in. If you have guests in these communities, definitely have those placed in the guest book before they arrive, and that's also for liability reasons in case something happens at the pool or on the tennis courts or the pickleball courts or whatever, um, or something you know, minor could happen on a walking path. You definitely want to have those guests registered in the guest book for the community for liability reasons. Okay, just getting that out of the way. Okay, back to the market. Let's see what's happened. Okay, so I'm all about singles today, you guys. So I wanted to see, because earlier I was like, wow, there are a lot of single white homes for sale right now, which is a little unusual. And I got to say that I like the singles myself. Uh, the one that I just helped a customer buy inside the community of Bay Lake Estates and uh, over often over between um, Nokomis and Bay Indies is one of their sister properties. And I just helped a customer buy in there. This single was fantastic. It was 56 feet long, it was furnished, and this seller did a great job. Not to mention it had a really big screen lanai on the carport by the laundry area on the one side of the home. Then you walked in and went down the hall, you know, it was all open because it's a single, and then on the opposite side was the Florida room. So you had all of this space in the single wide, not to mention it was 56 feet long, and it was a two bedroom, one bath. It was very, very nice. So never cancel out a signal and a single until you look at them. And another one of my favorites was over on the island. This was my customer, my seller, Kelly. She did a phenomenal job. This little 67 single was solid. It had been in the community for decades, and it was one of my favorites. It was very coastal chic. It had a um, very nice Florida room all along the one side, and then you stepped up into the remainder of the home, and it was just all one room with your living, your dining, and your kitchen, and then the bedroom was in the back with a built-in closet, and then on the lower level, you had a laundry room and then you had a private back patio. It was one of my favorite homes that I've sold and I've been doing this for years. It was awesome. It sticks out in my mind every time that I think about a really quaint single home. So never cancel them out because they're worth looking at for sure. Okay, so let's just see what's on the market today. So I'm on Realtor.com and I went into Inglewood. I'm starting in Inglewood today and then I'll head right up to Venice to see what, our, what we have up there. Because honestly, our inventory in Venice is really slender right now. So let's just go in and these are going to be either in land lease communities or some of these will be in real estate owned communities. So let's start out here and we'll work our way up to the top. So this one here is a single. It's a two bedroom, one bath. This is in the 34224 zip code and it's 1449 We have another one that's 372 square feet of space. 372 square feet of space. And it's a one bedroom, one bath, and it's 119.8. Then we go up, we have another single that is 730 square feet of space for just under 140,000. We have another one that's 670 square feet of space for 150. We have another single that's a one bedroom, one bath with 564 square feet of space for 121,000. Then we have another single with an additional lanai on the side for 160. Then we have another one that's 165, that's a two bedroom, one and a half bath. Then we have another one that's listed for 170,000, it's a two bedroom, one bath. Then we have another one that's listed for 179,9, that's a two bedroom, two bath. And then we have another one listed for 110, that's a one one. And then we have another one listed for 299,000, it's a one bedroom, one bath. And that is it right now for Inglewood in the singles. So let's go up to Venice and see what we can find. Here we have another single. This one is in a land lease community. It's priced just under 90,000. We have another one priced at 70. It's a one one. We have another one priced just below 100,000. It's a one bedroom, one bath. We have another one priced at 80,000. It's a one bedroom, one bath. We have another one priced around 70,000. That's a one bedroom, one bath. And that is it for Venice for a single wide at this very moment, currently available on the market. Let's see what we have if we go into Northport.
Here's one for 128,000. Here's one for 120,000. Here's one for 118,000. It's a two bedroom, one bath with 670 square feet. And that is it in Northport for a single wide. All right, let's go up to Nokomis. Do we have anything in Nokomis? We have one for 165,000. It's a single with 770 square feet. It's a one bedroom, one bath. And we have another one that is listed for $129.9. And we have another one listed for $149.9. We have another one listed for $72. Oh, no, sorry, that's a rental. No, I'm sorry, that's $72.9. And it's a one bedroom, one bath. And then we have another two bedroom, one bath in Nokomis, $34275 for just under $150,000. And those are the single wides that are currently available on the market in Inglewood, Venice, Northport, and Nokomis. So those are the single wides. So if you're looking for a single, don't dismiss it because some of these are very, very nice. They can be modernized. If you find one with dated windows, if you find one with carpet, if you find one that you just want to spruce up and make it your own, they're very fun projects. So if one of these are of interest to you, definitely let me know. SusanSwansonVenice at gmail.com. If you have a single to list, we're certainly happy to help you with that. We're your full service station with Sun Realty of Florida. SusanSwansonVenice at gmail.com. Let me know if any of these are of interest. Be sure and check out my most recent listing. It's a double wide. It is very, very nice. It's very modern. It has two bedrooms, two baths, and it has just a beautiful open modern floor plan, turnkey sheets to somewhere, and it's listed just below 155. So check that out and have a great day, everybody. It's great to see all of you. Cheers. Stay safe. Stay aware. Definitely stay tuned. Have a good one.